Hello, this is the Tachibana Tech Channel coming at you with another unboxing video. And today we will be unboxing the Iron Wolf Pro by Seagates. And it's different from the regular Barracuda Compute hard drive because this is meant for long-term storage and to go inside of a NAS. So as you can tell, this box is plain and boring, so we won't focus on that. I believe these are also commercial drives, but for the Iron Wolf Pros, they come in these plain boxes because they expect that consumers know what they're looking for. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this. All right. So this is the result of the nice hassle-free packaging. We have data recovery service, which is as nice for as big of a hard drive as these NAS drives come in. I think they start at eight terabytes and I don't know how long this gives you this rescue data services for so it does say you can make a claim at this link and we have a limited warranty which Seagate is pretty good about of the big names it's Western Digital that's I've heard is not very good with warranties and there's the hard drive. And that's the whole box. Unsurprisingly, there's nothing else in there. They haven't come with cords in a very long time. So, right off the bat, this thing is heavy. I mean, not impossibly heavy, but way heavier. And no easy way to open this. There we go. This thing is way heavier than their two terabyte drive. Um, oh wow. They are vastly different in size. Might be hard to tell there, but like... Check that out. It just has a whole hump above where this two terabyte drive is. For the most part, it looks... Identical on the outside. Expected nothing to be changed here other than it's using the space that's usually there. The Barracuda line is for regular computers, which is why it says compute. It's not designed to last as long or hold data as long. Whereas the Iron Wolf NAS, which is also called the Iron Wolf Pro line, is designed specifically for holding data for long periods of time. So now what you have to pay attention to with the Iron Wolf Pro line is that some of the smaller capacities have a smaller drive spin speed, and that will affect your access speed overall. I think this one we got because not only was it 12 terabytes, but it had the full spinning 7200 RPM drive. So at a glance, other than the fact that this is green branding and this is red branding, I believe the capacities for the compute stop at about 6 or 8 terabytes. Whereas the Iron Wolf will go all the way up to 20 terabytes. And obviously, if you do get this, you will have to account for the fact it's almost double the size of a regular compute drive. And it's much heavier, which won't matter once it's in the computer, but it taking up double the space will matter. And with that, I do believe that is the end of our Iron Wolf hard drive unboxing by Seagate. Let us know down in the comments if there's anything else you would like us to unbox, and we will go ahead and catch you guys next time.